Hey guys, welcome back to some more Ashes Cricket and part 27 of the 2017-18 Ashes series with England and today we continue our pursuit of the 727. We lost three wickets in the last episode, it really wasn't good. Stoneman ran out, Vince um, was caught for 47 and then Milan was stumped so stupidly. Uh, at the end of the last episode. So we're on 189 for four. We've got Bairstow and Root at the crease. We still need another 538 to win. This is going to be very, very difficult. But hopefully, hopefully, we can just about do it. Let's see what we can do in the final nine overs of the day. Um, they've brought off Nathan Lyon by the look. Oh, actually, I think Nathan Lyon was the, the, the last bowler of the last episode. So... Pat Cummins comes in and yet again, just wide. Nice shot. Four and, runs. You know, I've said this, we're just going to punish anything that's wide. You know, we'll give the normal deliveries that are, uh, that are good, the respect that they deserve, like that one. But anything that's wide or on the pads, we're just going to smack away. And that that's how we're going to work this. Uh, we're going to take our opportunities when we've got them. We're not going to try and force... Uh, opportunities but balls like that just deserve to be smacked away and you know I think and it sails to the boundary I think Australia Australian bowlers would be crucified in the media if they were doing this in real life because this is just terrible ball and it's not logical and yet another wide one but this time surely that's not out I don't think so. He's got his foot down, hasn't he? So, yeah, that's not out. Yes. Whew. I tell you what, I panicked there. I really, really panicked. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on with the crowd? <laughs> uh, they were predicting that. That's what's going on. <laughs> Oh, that was fantastic. Anyway, that's another four to the account. We've brought up the 200 now. Coming to the end of the 20 overs. That's another good shot. Great shot. And that might be another four. I think it is. So after 20 overs, we have reached 205 for four. Uh, and we are playing it like a 2020. You know, I've said this. We are we are going to attack and we're going to try and and do this. Wait. Yes. There's somebody out there. It's a good stop. He's uh, kept it in. Just a two. Nicely ran there. They'll get two. And hopefully Johnny Bairstow is going to support Joe Root here. Because, you know, batsmen have been getting starts and then nothing else. We're going to go for this. We're going to go for this. Get in there, my son. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. 112 metres was the six distance. And, yeah, balls like that just deserve to be smacked away. And Johnny Bairstow was the man to do it. We're not going to do it too often. But we will try when we get the opportunity. Oh, that might go for four. Oh, it has. What a shot. What a shot. And, you know, it was a, it was a deucer, actually. I, I went for that. Yep. Oh, we found the gap. Might not quite go for four. And that has done. Boundary. Four runs. Yeah, we're starting to smack. Yes. Nathan Lyon about now. That won't be getting to the rope on his watch. He'll get two for that. Good shot. This has been a fantastic over. We'll have seven left in today's episode. Right. After yeah. this, that was a really slow delivery. 
And that's going to be the end of the over. 2-2-4 two, two, four for four. Into the over, and the bowler will be very disappointed in that effort. Seven overs remaining in the day. Can we hang on? Yes. Can we hang on to these wickets? And can we get Joe Root to 50? I'm pretty sure we will. Can we get Johnny Bairstow to 50 as well? That would be the dream. Yeah, no! I don't know. Again, Australia, that first couple of balls just tightening up their uh, bowling a little bit. And, you know, it gets the respect it deserves. Um, but anything wide, as I've said, anything on the pads, we'll just go for it. Any full tosses, we'll smack for six. Gets through the infield, it might not quite go for four. Has it got the legs? Great shot. Oh, Run. it did just about have the legs. Um, I think that was more due to the fact that the fielders were too far away from it than, uh, than a brilliant shot. Yeah. I'm just going to be really careful. Try and keep these batsmen because, you know, apart from, Be uh, apart from Ben Stokes and Morn Alley, there's not much to come after this. This is, um, you know, this is pretty much our last hope. We need centuries from these two. We need to be probably in the the four five hundreds when these get out. That that is how serious the situation is. Here comes Nathan Lyon again. Yes. And yet again, very wide. No getting and past that fielder. And that's you know, if I had the bottle, I would have probably went for that, but it's it's a classic, uh, you know, delivery way you can edge it, so. Wait the Found the gap, but obviously there's a field on the boundary, so we're just going to stick with singles. And they go through for one. Doing it on 47. Johnny Bairstow on 21. Yes! On the pads once again. That goes for four. Oh, good, good four. Shot. I didn't expect that to go all the way to the boundary, but it is just testament to how quick this outfield is and when you've got a big, strong batsman like Johnny Bairstow in there. Yeah. Oh, that's out! This is the wicket they wanted. That's an important wicket, Bearston. Having their innings cut short just as it was getting going. Well, it must have been a top edge. Yeah. And he's gone now for 25 and the ashes are slipping away. Slowly but surely, Ben Stokes comes to the crease now. And this this truly is our last chance. One run there. It's a bit of an expensive over. Good over from the Aussies there. Five overs left. No. no. A bit of a mix-up. They'll need to uh. improve their communication. Shot. The good thing is Ben Stokes is Super you know, very well tuned to attacking and, and smacking the ball about the park, and that's exactly what's required from us now. You know, five wickets down. It's not very likely that we're going to go and get 700. Um, but we'll certainly try. Yep. 
good fielding out in the boundary. Very nice throw back there. Good fielding. He has played that nicely. Gets two. Little too eager in that delivery. No ball. That was a no ball. And wow. How far did he overstep the that? Baller needs to put those last deliveries behind him and focus on getting this right. Hmm. Decent over this from Cummins. Good shot from Ben Stokes. Just the two there. Two runs added. Very good over for the batsman. England moved to 245 runs for five. We're going to go for it. Tie in the air. Is it going to go for six? Oh, it's already in the stands. That was a big six. And that's going to be 54, the captain, Joe Root. That is exactly what we needed. And there you go, 11 fours and 1 six in 30 deliveries. Joe Root has gone to his 50. And what a shot that was as well. All the way into the crowd, sailing over the ropes for six. And we certainly are playing 2020 style here. Gonna go for it again, and there you go. That's a huge six. 123 meters that time, and it just feels really, really good to to have a smack of it. And there you go. You got any more of them in the in the locker, Nathan Lyon? There you go. Can we hit six sixes in the over? That is the question. That's 125 metres that time. We're really going for it. That's 18 runs in the over so far. Just really, really poor bowling, I think, from Nathan Lyon. And we're just picking him off. Nah, we're not going to go for that one. Just a single that time. One run added. You know, we we could have went for that, but it's a critical stage of the match. Unless I can pretty much guarantee that we're not going to get out from it, I'm not going to go for it. Catch it! I don't know what that was, but it's gone for six somehow. That was ridiculous. It looked like he was playing offside. It was it was very much like the James Vince one actually. Just don't know what that was. And I don't know how he did it. Goodness me. Let's go for it again. That one might not quite make the boundary, although it has done. 111 metres. Five sixes off the over. And I'll tell you what, Ben Stokes got it there a lot less effortless. A lot more effortlessly than uh, Joe Root. And look at that. The run's flowing freely. And that's a wagon wheel. Look at... I mean, I mean, just see the patterns of it. We've just smacked it in the same area as every over. And Pat Cummins comes back in. Three overs left. Joe Root on 66. Can we get him to his sentry? Yeah. I don't think we're going to do it in this episode, but... We'll certainly try. That's good running. Two runs added to the scoreboard. If we can bring 300 up in this episode, that would be amazing. Yep. It's ambitious, but... We've come back for three here. You know. And just and they get back squeeze those three. extra runs out, then... There's every chance that we could do it. Yep. It's 
especially when the ball on the pad's like that. Misjudged that and takes a hit on the body. On the front foot for the square drive. Good shot. Another run added. Just playing that one defensively. That's the end of that over. 286 for five. Two overs remaining in the day as Nathan Line, Nathan Line does continue. So can we whack him about a bit more here? Not with that delivery. It's a, it's a pretty good delivery to be honest with you. To a left hander. It was a deuce throw though. But there you go. That is what Ben Stokes is capable of. That is huge. 123. He's being punished out there. And you know, just balling just a just a hint too full. And I think the fuller your ball is a spinner, the more you open up to that. And there you go again. Oh, picks that one up nicely. It's just massive. Ben Stokes is a fabulous player and you know to have him at your disposal just really helps and there you go again that's three in a row and placement and we're, we're getting into the the stride a little bit here with the 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 spin ball out just slogging it around the the field and we've got two confident batsmen can we get stokes to 50. Gotcha. there's another one that's going to be his 50. Great shot. And it would have been great to see the battle between Stokes and Lyon in real life. Six sixes and two fours from Ben Stokes to bring up his 50. And still another delivery to go in this over. And we've brought up the 300. And all of a sudden, there's, there's hope again. <coughs> Playing all their shots that over, very expensive. Going the spin. And now Glenn Maxwell comes in for the final over of the day. Oh. Now Maxwell is a bit of a faster spin bowler than um, Nathan Lyon, so might be a bit more difficult to perform. We've ran four here though, that's a fantastic start to the over. Root moves into 75 now. Final over of the day. Wait. Yep. Oh, it's found the gap. Might get back for two here. Might just get back for two. And there you go. Good running. Gonna go for this. There we go, a tie in the air. Lovely it's shot. gonna be six. Oh, I'm loving this. I'm absolutely loving this. It feels like the first episode again when we were smacking it about the, the field when it was on easy difficulty, but I think it's just the, the condition of the pitch, it's just very good for batting and we're timing the ball so beautifully. Uh, and Australia have been bowling pretty shambolically in some of the overs. And, uh, you know, at the end of the day, we're five wickets down. I don't, I don't, still don't think that we're going to have a much chance of getting this 700, but we've given ourselves every opportunity. Can Ben Stokes end the day like he started? 
In, and there you go, that's another six. Only 77 metres that time, though. But that is six, and that is where we're going to end this episode. What a brilliant way to end it off with a wonderful six down the ground. Um, and just about managing it over the ropes for six. We've got a change in the commentary box. But uh, James I think this is going to be the end of the day. There you go. That is the end of the day, the end of the session, and we have ended it on uh, 329 for 5 at the end of day 4. Uh, Joe Root unbeaten on 84 with uh, Stokes on 56. We have uh, 329 runs for 5, um, and uh, we still require 398 more runs to win. But that is going to be in the final day where we'll have 90 overs to try and do it. Uh, hopefully weather won't come into it. We've got five wickets remaining. Hopefully we can pick up from where we've left off. Ben Stokes looks in the mood. Joe Root has uh, played some unbelievable strokes as well um, in this innings. And hopefully that can just continue. If you have enjoyed that, make sure you leave a like down below. It really does mean a lot for me really does help out the channel as well and i hope you guys are having a wonderful day thanks for watching and goodbye